This is Samantha Alvarez from samalvarez.com and this video is for the intuitives. In this video, I'm going to talk with you about how to take full advantage of your personal development style to learn something new. If you don't know what the heck I'm talking about when I say intuitive, take a look in the description below and you will find a link to a quiz where you can figure out which is your personal development style character. All right, so this video is for the intuitives and those who love them. To make this concrete for you, I'm going to give you a specific example of how to use your personal development style. Let's say you've decided to learn a language. You've decided to learn Spanish. Ole! Muy bien, muy bien, muy bien! Oops, sorry. Anyway, you've decided to learn Spanish and you want to know how to best use your personality style's strengths, how to get around your weaknesses, and what to do when you get stuck, as we all inevitably will. So that's exactly what we're going to talk about. As the intuitive, your most important tool for starting a new project, such as language learning, is your gut instinct. So when you're starting a new project like this, the most important thing to do is check in with your intuition and figure out why it is that you're doing what you're doing, and then also what exactly it is that you want to do, how you should go about it, and making sure that now is the right time. While it's important at the beginning of a project to really check in consciously with yourself and be at, at peace and at one with your own intuition, as a project gets going, that can actually slow you down if you're doing too much self-reflection. So there's an inflection point that you get to where you really want to let go of the control and you just want to go with the flow to learn the thing, talk to the people, do what it is that you want to do. However, if you get stuck in your language learning journey, that's a time to then pull back and sit down and do meditate or do yoga or just sit with your feelings, whatever it is that you do to get in touch with yourself and feel around about what's making you feel stuck. And if all else fails, I recommend taking a three to seven day mindful break from your language learning to give yourself time to rest and give your brain a little bit of time to remember where the motivation came from. And then once the three to seven day break is up, then you can re-engage. And that is how you leverage your personal development character to learn a language or anything else. And if you'd like to see more videos like this, subscribe below.